What is going on guys? You have reached Zach Baby TV coming at you live to do a very special unboxing that I have received from one of my ultimate fans on my channel. Shout out to Josh Wasaki. Awesome guy. He sent me this really heavy, awesome green box full of some serious nostalgia goodness. So let's go ahead and get started, okay? Get ready. Here we go, guys. Here it is right here. This thing is massive, and it even comes with handles. This thing is big, okay? And it's heavy. This thing's like five pounds, maybe like eight pounds or something. So let's go ahead and dive into it. Monsterville, beware of the claw. Ghosts of Fear Street. Who's been sleeping in my grave? Olympian Zeus, King of the Gods. The Walking Dead comic book. Cool. Darth Vader comic. James Bond comic. Scary stories to tell in the dark. Yeah, awesome. Spooksville, awesome. This is just like Goosebumps in Are You Afraid of the Dark? Uh, Christopher Pike. Um, I think there's 18 of these books and they made like one season on Netflix based off a lot of the books and there was talk about a second season but I don't know if they ever did it. But Spooksville is really freaking cool and it's weird how like 20 something years later they did something for Netflix for it um, but it definitely deserved way more than it got like Spooksville is really good Death of Spider-Man comic Superwoman a lot of comics in here Batman Beyond comic I used to collect comic books, not anymore. The Amazing Spider-Man. Number one. Ooh. Darth Maul. Scooby Apocalypse. Just a lot of random stuff he sent me. Howard the Duck comic. Spider-Man, again. I love Spider-Man. Definitely one of my favorites. Rick and Morty comic, cool. We got a hardcover book called Ghost Dog Secrets. Never heard of this. Ghost Dog Secrets. Oh yeah, Ooh, number seven, Fear, X-Files book, yes sir. This is like a third collection that I'm gonna be working on. I started collecting X-Files, but honestly I have no room for it. Um, so, once we move and we have a house, if it's not a basement, I'm converting the garage into a man cave. Like I'm literally gonna demo the garage door and have a contractor construction company like seal it in so it's just one big room for shelves posters I'm gonna get a big orange couch like Nickelodeon snick at night with a TV and outside of that carpet and I'm gonna have like a refrigerator in there or like a big uh, freezer you know for sodas and stuff and it's just going to be all 90s nostalgia, all goosebumps, Are You Afraid of the Dark, X-Files, and who else? Who knows? Yeah. So far, those are the top three for me. So, yeah. Awesome. This is probably the coolest thing so far. Thank you, Josh. Nightmares. This is a thick book. Part two, Nightmares. Don't worry, you'll wake up if you're lucky. Zombies. 
it's like a huge colorful comic book. That's pretty cool looking. Oh, sweetness, ultimate goosebumps. Horrorland, yeah. Very cool, I already have this, but it's awesome. It's still goosebumps, I want it, I'll take it. <sighs> Carnage. Carnage is my favorite character, my, char my favorite villain from Spider-Man. I love me some Venom, but there's just something about Carnage with all that stuff that comes off of him and uh, he's just way creepier to me. And the last item here is ooh, a mystery story called Closed for the Season. That looks really cool. That looks like a, a spooky thriller adventure. Never heard of it. Definitely going to check it out. came out in 2009. I really like the cover though. It looks like it's some abandoned area in the woods and they're going to explore it. Oh, I love that. Thank you, Josh. Shout out to Josh. I appreciate you sending me the fan mail. It was amazing. There's a lot of cool stuff in here. I'm not terribly into comic books anymore. Um, but they're still cool to, you know, to look through. I really appreciate it. There is a couple books in here that I am very interested in checking out. I think my favorite thing in here is probably the X-Files book. Um, of course, the Goosebumps one, the uh, Ghost Dog Secrets. Uh, some really cool stuff, Josh. I appreciate it. Make sure you uh, like, comment, and subscribe. And if you want to send me something in the mail, I will definitely do an unboxing for you as well. Um, just contact me by send me a message here, or you could contact me privately on Instagram or on my fan Facebook page, Zach Baby TV. So. Uh, enjoy the rest of your weekend, and we will see you next time.